What in the fuck's going on? We haven't solved another case yet, and, and now another mass murder. And you're saying the murderer is Scissor Man? But it's true. I saw him clearly. Oh boy, oh boy. I forgot his voice. I sure hope you weren't daydreaming with Jennifer. Well, we're done questioning you for now. You can go home. You can go on home now, Teach. Hmm. Oh, but don't go anywhere too far for a while. Because I'll probably have to call you in again. Soon. I know, Guts. Okay, hey, Jono here. Thank you for joining me for Clock Tower. Things staying a little... A little bumpily. Uh, mainly because I concluded the episode just before opening the door... Uh at the end of last episode and it was like oh I cleared the scenario so yeah I'm not gonna start an episode 30 seconds and with scenario cleared cool so we're not talking to him we'll talk to Jennifer I guess hey Owen. it's alright Jennifer let's keep looking for more clues about Scissorman if we don't do something ourselves he'll probably kill you Oh, us. But mostly you. No need for sarcasm, Teach. I really do want to believe your story, you know. Was it the real scissor man? Yes, but I don't know if it was the same one who attacked you before. But he sure didn't look human to me. Well, shall we go? Okay. Somehow I must find a clue about Scissor Man. Well, wouldn't we we we're like the research building? The investigation of the scene seems to be over. Okay. Yeah, it seems like going here would be the way to go. Helen, are you all right? Yes, but more importantly, can we use the toilet room now? Yes, but we couldn't get in all morning because of the investigation. By the way, Beth, I'd like to take a look at the statue. You mean the one they found at the scene of the crime? Or clock tower murders? Right, I think Professor Barton had it. Well, he did, but I think he asked someone to take a look at it. It's not here? No, and Professor Barton isn't either. He's away on some police business. Don, I wanted to look at the statue because I was hoping it would give me a clue. About Scissor Man. Did he tell you where he was taking it? I think he said he would either take it to the library or to a man named Rick. Just a random man. If he took it to the library, that would mean Mr. Sullivan. But who is Rick? I don't know. Alright, I'll go over to the library. I'll call Mr. Sullivan. Thanks. Alright. But we know it's not there. Where's the fucking ah? The Municipal Library. I wonder if Professor Sullivan is there. Hmm. What can we look at? This painting. Excuse me, is Mr. Sullivan here? No, he hasn't come back yet. Oh, I see. Really? What the fuck was the point of that? Um. Hmm. Police Street. Well, police station, I guess it is. 
Um, doesn't seem like the way to go. The newspaper, maybe? The hotel? The library? So weird to be like, yeah, go to the library. And then it's like, eh, let's try staff housing. The house is surrounded by reporters. I shouldn't go anywhere near there now. Okay, thank you. Maybe try here again? Maybe I should go back to the university. I hope you find the statue. Fuck. Okay. Let's try the hotel. I wonder if Edward is there. Helen, I heard that you were attacked by Scissor Man. Yes, I was. I don't know if he was the same one as in the clock tab case, though. Maybe he will go after Edward, too. Where is Edward? I think he is in the library. He seems to like it there. I'll go there and check on him, then. Would you? Because I'm not. I'm just this guardian. Please tell him to come back soon. Back to the library. We were just fucking near. Yep, the library. Well, we're not worried about that. We're worried about, like, Edward. It's Edward here. No, we're not worried about Mr. Sullivan. No, he hasn't come back yet. Can I... Why is everything fucking telling me to go to the library and then there's no fucking point? Try the newspaper. No reason to go to the newspaper office. Try the police. Oh yes, I will ask Gots about Rick. Maybe it's because we know... Well, we picked to take it to Rick. It's just kind of annoying that everything's like... Edward's at the library. Oh, I'll go check on it. Okay, nah. Oh, I'll go talk to this guy at the library. Even if he's there and he just says, he didn't give me the statue. Well, who's Rick? You know, something like that. All right, let's talk to his butt. Got any new info, Teach? Do you know a man named Rick? Rick? That sounds familiar. Hmm. Oh, yeah. He's the old geezer that used to be the butler for the Barrows family. The Barrows family? Of the Clock Tower case? That would mean he... Well, he quit ten years before it all happened. I went to see him once, but he didn't know anything... ...about the case. But anyway, what about him? Well, what about him? Well, Professor Barton might have given the statue... ...to... ...him. The statue? What for? That statue just might be the key to the secret of the ooze. Scissor Man. I think Professor Barton wanted him to look at the statue and it. I see. And since you believe in Scissor Man, you want to get your hands on it too. Tap that ass. Well, if you want to put it that way... Well, we ain't got any other leads, do we? I can go and get it. Oh. You will? All I have to do is talk to Rick and get the statue. Right? Nothing to it. Yes, but... But, but... Ask Gots. Yes or no. Alright. Ask him to get it? Would you? Sure, I'll go now. Please be careful. Scenario 2. Stan Gotts. Oh, I see. Is that how it is? Was. Yeah, if you know something, Gramps, tell me. Right now I'm looking for a clue. Any clue. I'm clueless. Hmm... Mr. Gotts, do you know of a castle called Barrow's Castle? 
Barrow's Castle? Sorry, that's my phone. Yes, it is a castle in England. Then, before the Barrow's family moved? Yes, that is what I have heard over 80 years ago. What the fuck? Is there a dog outside? So, what's up with the castle? A monster was once born there that terrorised the local children. The dog. How's that? That would be Scissor Man. Why? I had always thought it a fairy tale. Well, what happened to the monster? He was killed by his father. His father was the head of the household of the 13th generation of Barrows. So the old man killed his own son? Listen, Gramps, do you know where the castle is? Give me a moment, please. I am sure that's somewhere. There is. And a dog. What the fuck? What does he want now? He just fed that stupid butt. Shut the fuck up! Oh, I almost got the voice right anyway. It's okay, boy. What's the matter? Don't make such a racket. Oh! <laughs> okay. Fucking Cujo. It's you, you made the dog attack? Yeah, <laughs> just shoot him dead. The end. Game over. Might want to run, buddy. I got to get out of here. Wait. Do that. I don't know what that is. Basement? Oh, you just hide? Okay. I thought it might lead to like a cellar or some shit. I need loading them. Alright. Is there any other doors in here? Because you think it'd be a little more thorough if it's the only way in. Bye, Scissor Man. That squeakiness reminds me of sounds from Tomb Raider 3. Success. Light traps and such. A microwave oven. There is something inside wrapped in foil. Ooh. Is it a burrito? Are you gonna, you know, get it? Okay. Alright, we're not interested. Okay. Well, what's this? There is a cooking utensil inside. This can't be used as a weapon. Alright. It's gonna be a little more thorough because. <laughs> Fucking stupid mouse curse was in the way. Oh, it looked funny. Oh, <laughs> don't forget, scissor man. I think it is clean and in order. I wish my old lady could see this. The fuck? There is some garbage in it. Alright, the table. Check the table, yeah. The tablecloth is covering the table. Fucking things you pick up on to comment. A very heavy looking flower vase. A 
wooden mask. Probably a souvenir from Africa or somewhere. Oh. Okay. What the fuck? Am I meant to do something? Can't select anything. Ah, wait, the bars? Fuck you, mask! That was weird. <laughs> Tablecloth, it's covering the table. So does Scissor Man have that ability or is that just bad luck anyway? Something is written. You have discovered hint number eight. Okay. What's this thing? A trash can. Alright. Oh, I didn't try to open that. Yeah, I just don't want to miss a key or something and you know feel like I'm stuck because that other place yeah I was very lucky I feel I mean pliers were the only thing I had to really go out of my way for hmm. run 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 oh I see okay an umbrella stand might as well stay on the ground floor for now. Alright. It simply will not open. Fuck! He locked me in and he's taking his time to kill me. And I'm taking my time to run away. So I guess it all balances out. Can I change the camera again? No. Alright. Please run up the stairs. Fuck yeah. But then take forever to open the door. Okay. The camera doesn't move, so there might not be more to that area. <laughs> Is there anything else to check out before I go near that? Doesn't look like it. Not even the fire plate. Oh, hang on. No, I guess it's that. Alright. It's Tom and Jerry. Oh, what did you expect? Oh. Is that scissor man? Oh, this is the second door. Damn it, which one? Which one did I come through? Quickly! Ah. Quickly! Can you hide under that bed? Ah, okay. Can we do this automatically? Haha! <laughs> <laughs> Your natural enemy! The fucking blanket! Uh, only problem is... I kinda need to check that room. You know, that's the only room left to me. Okay, and he's invisible. Just garbage. A closet. There is a gown hanging inside. Is there another door? Or is that curtains? Alright. What's this? 
this. An alarm clock is set for 6 a.m. Can I do anything with that? A Bible. God's always sleeping when you need him most. Okay. Hmm. Is that random square nothing? Oh, there's two. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. Fair enough. I was tapping. Oh. Fuck, what's the point? There is only the two. Maybe try it again, just in case he actually... He doesn't even comment. That's disappointing. Oh well. Is this just junk again? Yeah, garbage. Okay. So I'm not too sure where else I can really be heading. What if I just try running to here? Yeah, see the camera doesn't tell. Let's try this room again, just in case there's now something new. Yeah, see the angles will change. Ah! There is a statue about 30 centimeters tall standing on the table. What the fuck is this? Oh yeah, this has got to be the statue Teach was talking about. You now have the statue. So yeah, you couldn't check any of this last time. It looks like a flower vase. Because it is, you idiot. Cut out newspaper articles are laying on the table. They are all about what happened yesterday. Oh fuck, that old geezer must have known. Something. There are many mystery novels. Hey, I've read this one. Alright, so I guess it is not the fireplace. A rather comfortable looking rocking chair. An old television set. I guess it just leads to where I was before. Alright. But there's still this one, isn't there? Or does it not matter? Yeah. Weird. It's like, that implies there's like a third room, but right between these two. Oh. Actually. Was that from me using the cursor, or was that just to fuck with me? Alright, what's this? A painting by a famous artist. Who has no name. Yeah, because see, unless it's off the screen, there's nothing here. So I don't know what to do now. Maybe downstairs? Ah. Wrong door. 
Come on, Mr. Gots. We don't have much time left. Don't swear, I'm sure I tried this door for the bedroom the first time. Try to find the door again. It simply will not open. Yeah. It's locked me in. Yes. God. If you're going to make him say shit again, just fucking no. So what else could be here? Ah, okay. Oh shit, that's not good though. Wait, he might be coming from... I was going to say he's coming from this room, but maybe he's not. I have to take the game. Yeah, okay. Door number one. A bathroom. Okay. No. Oh. Bathtub. Ah, there we go. The shower. Oh, it takes so long just for him to state what it is. Maybe he's blood on his hands. Only toilet trees. Ah, the throne. This ain't no time to take a leak. What's that? There are some towels. All right, well, we'll check the other room. And then see what we're in for. So I didn't check any of that. Hmm, can I flick on a light switch? It's so dark. A washing machine. It is full of water. Yeah, but what's the basket? Not interested? Okay. More towels? There's some detergent on the shelf. This could be used to blind someone. You now have the powder soap? Odd. And a stick. There is some laundry inside. Hole is leaning against the wall. It looks like a mop handle. You're not going to take it? Alright. Strange. What a waste. This chest can still be used. What do you mean? A chest that is no longer being used. What do you mean a chest? I can't see it, it's like pitch black. 
Oh, well, that's it for this episode. In the next one, we will check what little is left of the house and try and work out how to get out of here. So until then, thank you very much for watching and take it easy.